Hi Rebel Loves, welcome back to my channel. I am here with more Solgi reactions. We are doing her Bad Boy Sad Girl featuring Bio special video along with her 28 Reasons performance video. Y'all, I got to watch every single one of her stages this week. They were amazing, amazing. Like literally, I was blown away, uh, speechless, everything. Her outfits were absolutely stunning. The stages were so like extravagant and beautiful and it's exactly what Solgi deserves. She sounded amazing. Literally, like, I, everything. Everything. I just absolutely love and adore Solgi. So, I'm so excited to get into these. The first one we're going to start with is the Bad Boy Sad Girl special video. So, let's go ahead and get into this. That was amazing. I love that they did a special video together. Um, I saw her performance of this song on, what is it, K909 with Boa. I, she looked at me, like, literally everything. Her her voice is just so stunning that literally no matter what she sings, whether it's like a powerful song like 28 Reasons or Dead Man Running or like a softer song like Bad Boy Psych, she just sounds like everything fits her voice. She sounds amazing. Um, and this album has been to die for, to die for. I have been like running through it nonstop this week. Uh, it's just so good. Easily, easily one of my favorite albums released this year. Absolutely incredible debut. Oh, I just love this. I am so excited to get into this performance video. Oh my goodness. The stills I saw from this, she looked incredible. Incredible. So let's go ahead and get into the 28 Reasons performance video. Kiss your brother, come on, Don't keep pleasure, don't want to my pleasure. Good and don't lean on no bit. Good on our 
I'm breaking every rule. 자꾸만 괴롭히고 싶은 걸. 이제 28 reasons for love. 돈돼 나쁜 의도 없어 내게. 이제 28 reasons 다 아는데 왜또 다시 내게 기대. You know what I find really interesting, and I think it's one of the main reasons I love watching Sogi dance, is I feel like when I'm watching other idols and other groups and them dance, I feel like the part of the choreo that they always forget is like the hand placement and what to do with their hands. Because a lot of the times you have really pretty nice lines and extensions f from like every part of your body ex and it stops here. Like, I feel like n some idols don't put as much emphasis on following the line all the way through to their fingertips and if you'll notice a lot of the rea dance practice reactions I do um I'll talk about whether or not like someone when someone usually catches my attention or I really really like um and comment on them it's usually about like how well how like graceful their hand placements are um and Sogi emphasizes hand choreo so much in this um song that she has to be like hand placement has to be emphasized hand placement is has to be perfect in order for it to look good because she's doing so much choreo with it like the camera work and everything is always focused on her hands um and so i've always really appreciate that she thinks of every single like every single part of her body is utilized to do the choreo um she doesn't miss like a single detail in anything um, so I'm gonna go back and play this whole choreo, uh, this whole chorus choreo. Yeah, I like stayed up all night trying to learn this choreo because I love it that much. <laughs> Before we get into this high note, because I know it's about to be exceptional, the that part she okay in the MV the camera work helps her with that bounce, um, but when she does it by herself without utilizing the extra help from the camera work, it's still really really good. Like she just has like that much control over her body. I love how much like they breathe in this. Um, like you can tell they like feel the music they are literally like breathing through this choreo um it's so good like not even just sogi like sogi and her dancers like this part 
want to watch from the high note again just because even like all her the but it's okay every move is so impactful even like all of this little they're barely moving my goodness like here's the thing uh Sulgi is my favorite third gen female dancer she's probably my favorite female dancer in the k-pop industry um and so I think what people don't realize because I feel like even with how fantastic she is she is by far 100% a very very underappreciated dancer like, a lot of people talk about her vocals, rightfully so. Sulky is a beautiful, beautiful vocalist. Probably, like, the strongest, like, lead vocalist in the industry. Crazy. Um, but she is such a versatile dancer, and I don't think people realize that. Like, she is crazy good at what she does. Um, and so the fact that when people talk about really good dancers especially in third gen, and I never see Solgi, I'm like, how? Why? Why? Um, because she's just so good at her craft. And she does so many genres. I feel like she doesn't have like a set style of dance that she is really like attached to. Like if I, if I can give the best example um, that I can think of, uh, like when we talk about, when I talk about NCT's G-Song, I always attribute like popping to Jisun. That is his style, his element, everything. Mark, very, very hip hop, his style. With Solgi, Solgi does so much. She's like a jack of all trades. Um, that it's really hard to like pinpoint her with a specific style. Because she's constantly like expanding her range and trying different things, trying different dance styles. And that's why I think like a lot of dance styles look really, really good on Solgi. So um, but really just loved, love 28 Reasons. By far, like, one of my favorite debuts ever. Ever. It was so good. One of my favorite songs released this year. One, one of the top albums released this year. Everything. I could not be any prouder of, of her. I cannot wait to get my albums. I, they, I don't even think they've shipped. But I'm super, super excited to get those. I will literally shed tears when they are in my hand. But super, super proud of her and excited to see the rest of her stages and the rest of her like performances and um, everything she continues to do with this debut. And I hope she's having like a great time promoting it. So, but with that being said, be on the lookout for my next Red Velvet or Solgi reaction and I will see you guys next time. Bye Rebel Loves.